Hi, I'm Lou Ann Hammond, DrivingTheNation.com. I am here with Rene Hinterberger, and he is the product specialist for intelligent glass, or as I like to call it, smart glass. <laughs> Since we have everything else that's smart, smartphone, everything else, this is kind of smart. That's right, yeah. It's, yeah. it's a brand new feature, I would say. Um, the integration, like we have it here, is one of a kind. It is on the market already, let's say for the sunroof, but uh, like we have it here, to apply it on all windows, it's uh, first sample how it could look like. Okay, so what I love about this is where I'm from in Northern California, it can get like 110 degrees, mm. almost 50 degrees Celsius, and it gets really hot in your car. Mm. What you can do here is actually darken all of the entire windows Get out of the car when you get back in. You said it's like twenty percent. Yeah, reduction cool. of the interior yeah. heat. Yeah, it's really that comfortable. That's fabulous. Okay, yeah. so can you actually darken the entire uh, windshield? Uh, the windshield is a little bit tricky as there are some legal regulations, but we have some marking here until where it is allowed to put it. Put it right. Um, and we need to stay within those regulations. Right. Uh, but still, it helps quite a lot if you have all those glasses covered and keep only the windscreen clear. So it'd be really fun, like if somebody's over on the other side and, yeah. and they're looking at you, they're mad at you, and all of a sudden you just tent your window and it's like, talk to the glass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we had it the other way around when uh, one of the management guy was sitting in the car and uh, the people passing by tried to see inside and they were not able to see who is in there. And he just touched the button and then suddenly he was visible and they, ooh, oh. big boss, let's go away. <laughs> it was nice. <laughs> now, can you do this by iPad? Like if you take your, uh, do you have an app to do it with? Yes, or? yes. I mean, yes. this is just a, a demonstration. Shall we show how it could look like? Yes. Um, at oh, the end, right. we think the customer will not use it that way. It should be done more automatically. Right. And that's also what we are focusing on. So we have uh, implemented quite a lot of different sensors in the car. And basically what this does now, the car detects the position of the sun and then it tints especially those glasses which are required to be tinted to have it very comfortable inside. Nice. And having the dark window which is towards the sun and not be blinded anymore. Great. Now, uh, when will this come out on the market? Um, actually, it should or it is available. Um, it's just someone needs to pay the first R&D invest and it takes some time until you get really mass production, so it tickles down to the mid-class cars, I would say. It's still a high-class feature with this technology, but there are quite a lot of other technologies coming up, mm -hmm. um, which are cheaper and also have a different color, for example, oh, and mood, a different response mood time. Lighting. Yeah, for yeah, example. Right. So there are a lot of possibilities with this. Yeah, because you were saying over in Asia, they really love this area. Yes, this. yes, exactly. Yes. Can, you, can you do it again so I could film? You did it really fast when you did the lights. Oh, okay, what, what, I can maybe I can show you the demo mode. So okay. because I don't, I want to avoid driving around. Yeah, sure. Okay. So we had, a, for, for example, also some demo mode. So we can position here a sun, and this would be also the position uh, which is calculated by the car. So it knows, okay, the sun is over here, so it darkens that one. Right. And if I move it around, then it darkens that one. Oh, Sorry, right. Sorry, got touch here. And that's also actually what it's doing. So if I move it here, you can see the glass is changing and really changing the It changes the tinting. so quickly though. Yeah, it's, it's quite fast. Right. Okay, do it right. a couple times, please. So if I move it here around, you can see it gets dark here and then the back area clears up here. So this is then the automatic mode. And when we drive around, um, that's what it looks like. Also, when you enter the parking lot, for example, it clears up and the exit again, getting the bright sun, it darkens right. again. So this is the integration in the car system then and using the sensors which we have here. Great. All right. Renee, thank you very much. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs>